The U.S. confirms the MQ-9 Reaper drone has been regularly deployed over the Black Sea, which has become an increasingly crowded airspace. But a Pentagon spokesperson says this is the first direct air confrontation since the Russian invasion of Ukraine. What we saw, again, were, were fighter aircraft dumping fuel in front of this uh, UAV uh, and then getting so close to the aircraft that it actually damaged the propeller on the MQ-9. Uh, we, we assess that it likely caused some damage to the Russian aircraft as well. The Russian Defense Ministry has a different version of events, insisting the drone crashed after maneuvering sharply while approaching the Crimean coast. The Russian ambassador was summoned to the U.S. State Department, and afterwards he gave what seemed to be more a justification than a denial. This uh, drone can carry 1,700 kilos of explosives. This drone can carry a few bombs. You see that what will be reaction of United States if you see such Russian drone very close, for example, to San Francisco or New York? What will, will be reaction of United States? A national security liaison officer at the White House echoed the Pentagon in describing the Russian action as reckless and unprofessional, confirming the president was informed straight after the incident. The key issue, say U.S. intelligence sources, whether the Russian pilots were acting unilaterally or under command. Mike Hanna, Al Jazeera, Washington.